Okay, so you've got, you know, you've got some shadows here, but you can tell that, you know, this is a nice looking lawn here, emerald zoysia. And we're going to walk up here and I want to show you, um, you know, okay, now you look and you see this big, this big spot. And so I, I asked the customer, I said, you know, is this something that just appeared all of a sudden or has it been kind of gradual? He said he went out of town. Um, a couple weeks ago and came back and and this was here so it, it was more sudden you know and so uh, and it's not a spot that has, has shown damage in the past it just all of a sudden this spot starts to show up and the problem is in a beautiful lawn like this you've got emerald zoysia it's got a little bit of Bermuda in here and what happens is you get a bare spot and the Bermuda starts filling in that bare spot before the zoysia so because the Bermuda just grows much faster and is a lot quicker to take over. So that's my concern is that he's gonna end up having Bermuda fill back in. But I wanna show you what caused this brown spot because if you didn't know better, you'd think, you know, it, yeah, it looks like maybe not watering it enough. But like I said, we, we've had tons of rain this year. So um, water is not the issue. And, and you can tell also the rest of the grass being nice and green um it, that wouldn't make sense to have one spot that's underwater you know and then sometimes you see a spot like this there can be sometimes something underground that causes problems um you know i've seen it where they you know have a some sort of underground drainage system so there's just very shallow dirt so it's more likely to dry out quicker uh, but that's not the case here either it, it's it's something else so let me show you what the problem is Let's see if I can actually find it, but you can see here, um, you know, looking bad. Might take me just a minute. Okay, I found the problem. Maybe a little difficult to see, but we're going to try. You see those little little guys crawling around? Those are chinch bugs. Chinch bugs have caused this damage to this grass. And on, in this case, I was actually able just to, by looking down close at the turf, to actually see the chinch bugs. Now, I can't, if you look all over the damaged area, there's not uh, chinch bugs in the entire area. So you might have to look a little bit. But I'll say, um, and this is something I've been, been learning about, and I, I rely heavily on my Harold's um, fertilizer rep. helps me sometimes identify these problems. But when I see a problem like this, and this, you know, like I said, if it, if it looks like drought damage, but you've had plenty of water, then it's a possibility that it could be chinch bugs. So now let me show you what we're going to do about it. All right, so we've identified the problem as chinch bugs, and I want to show you this product I'm using, Tau Star Pro. And if you read the label on Towsar, it'll tell you for chinch bugs, and there's a little note by them. It says, chinch bugs are one of the more, most difficult pests to control in a lawn. And so they recommend using a higher rate, up to one ounce per thousand square feet. So for me, I'm just going to mix up a, a gallon in a little handheld sprayer. Not gonna, no need to um, spray the entire lawn. And so I'm just going to mix one ounce in one gallon of water and spray um, with a handheld two-gallon sprayer, spray the damaged area and, and a little bit outside the damaged area. So um, like I said, not just the damaged area, but I want to I want to go a little bit wider. That way if they've spread um, and then I want to talk to the homeowner about you know if you have any further sign of damage you know let me know as soon as possible that i can come out here and 
and take care of again. So if you want to be extra safe and feel like you need to spray your whole yard, um, you can, but um, you know, it, it, most of the time if you just spray in the area where the chinch bugs are, this should take care of the problem. So anyway, I hope this has been helpful of what might be causing a brown spot in your lawn. If it looks like drought and you had plenty of water, you might want to get down there and see if you can actually see the chinch bugs. If so, Talstar Pro um, is one product that you can use to get rid of them. If you haven't done so, go ahead and subscribe to the channel and look forward to providing more lawn care information to you. Thanks.